Today we're given a classic piece of equipment, the Yaesu FT-101, a brand new look. Stay tuned as I show you how I repainted this legendary radio and its accessories. Before we dive in, let's gear up with the essentials. Here's what you'll need. You'll see a lot of people online saying winter gray matches the factory paint. I highly disagree, so I chose to go with satin granite. Since I'm repainting every piece, it doesn't need to match, and it looks so good. Got everything? Great, let's get started. First up, we're disassembling the radio. Safety first. Make sure your radio is unplugged and caps have been drained. Remove the screws. Handle each piece carefully and keep those screws safe. We'll need them later. Time to prep the surface. Sanding is key to smooth professional finish. You could start with coarse grit sandpaper, but finish with something like 400 to 600 grit for a smooth finish. Don't forget the screws. It might seem tedious, but it's crucial for a uniform look. Now we'll need to clean everything. A clean surface is a must for good paint adhesion. Now the fun part, painting. We're using Rust-Oleum Satin Granite for the panels and screws. Multiple light coats give the best coverage. Patience pays off here. For the trim, we're using Krylon Pewter Gray. Let's give it a sleek new look. Let everything sit and cure for 24 hours. This ensures a durable finish. Now we could reassemble our freshly painted Yesu FT-101. And there you have it. Your FT-101 looks as good as new, ready for action. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more exciting projects.